Tonight, there is a new reality in the housing crisis in Metro Atlanta. It's cheaper to rent than to actually buy. It's a problem in the 50 largest cities in the country, and we are committed to following this story here on WSB tonight. Channel 2's Michael Doudna is live in Sandy Springs, where, Michael, so many people, including so many people in our newsroom, say that they simply can't afford to buy. Yeah, Wendy, it's a pretty common story that you're seeing more and more. And according to this new report, for those, when you compare those people who rent, let's say the people here in Sandy Springs and these nice apartments to those who own starter homes, well, it's those new homeowners who are spending hundreds of dollars more a month in monthly payments. You see the prices, 400000 starting at 500000 starting at 700. Everywhere Cedric Thomas looks, it feels like all he sees are unattainable homes. It's not even worth looking at it because you already know you're going to be able to afford it. And in a world where home and rent prices have gone up nearly 30% nationwide, he's far from alone. I did want to own a home, but as we as getting older, it's looking less and less feasible. It's looking like renting is just the better option all around. And according to Realtor.com, that divide is growing. Because in every metro area, it is now more expensive on a month-to-month -month basis to own a starter home than to rent. And that's not including the down payment. We're looking at $840 more per month um, to own a home versus rent a home in Atlanta. Senior economic research analyst Hannah Jones says that puts Atlanta in about middle of the pack nationwide. And although prices have leveled off, there is still a deep divide. We saw that... You know, the cost of purchasing a home, um, you know, that, that monthly payment is 52% higher than rent. The difference in the two payments is half of my monthly income. And for Cedric, this is all frustrating. As a college-educated 26-year-old man, feeling that the American dream has changed from a house with a picket fence to something much more basic. It's now, as long as you have a place to call your own, that's the dream at this point. Just being able to move out of your parents' house is the American dream. Now, if there is some good news, according to Realtor.com, well, rent prices have either dropped or stayed the same in Atlanta for 19 straight months. In fact, year over year, prices are down around 4.5%. But on the flip side, starter home prices are up more than 5%. We're live in Sandy Springs. Michael Doudna. WSB tonight. Yeah, those starter home prices are incredible. It makes you wonder if you'll ever get there. And people are saying that's just not a reality for them anymore. Michael, thank you. Yeah.